Hi guys, it's MJ here with a quick news update. We have got some news from the London Toy Fair. Uh, Brickfanatics.co.uk have seen uh, the sets and have um, provided some details. Uh, so the X-Men set, the Summer X-Men set, is going to be £44.99, so fairly reasonably expensive really. Uh, it's going to have the a small like X jet, so like not the Blackbird, and um, different to the actual X jet that appeared in the Lego Marvel Super Heroes video game. Uh, the minifigures they didn't actually mention Wolverine or the Sentinel, but they did say that the set's going to have uh, Cyclops in his Astonishing X Men costume, uh, and then we've seen the pictures of Storm and Magneto as well. Uh, now, as they didn't mention Wolverine or the Sentinel, it, it may be that they didn't see the full details of the set or the full set. Uh, you know, for £45, I would kind of hope that we get more than four minifigures, especially as two of them are figures that we've already got, or characters that we've already got. Um, I, I would hope that there's five. I mean, I know we're getting a Sentinel as well, but that is part of the brick-built set. Also, so, from the pictures that we've seen and from the descriptions, it doesn't sound like the jet is very big, and the Sentinel's not very big. Um... I'd say the Sentinel's similar in size to maybe a Legend Beast, a Chima Legend Beast, or maybe a bit smaller, and they're only £8. Um, so, kind of for f uh, £35, £40, pounds, we're, not, we're not getting much, really, for the remainder of that set. Uh, there is al also news in, this, in the sense that the superheroes range as a whole is uh, an evergreen line for LEGO now. What that means is it's... In, as integral to their business and as important to them as both the Star Wars and the Lego City lines, um, which is really absolutely fantastic news. Uh, it means that the, the Rangers are probably going to go on for a long, long time. Uh, there is also some slight news on the Guardians of the Galaxy sets. First of all, it looks like we're getting a brick-built Groot. Uh, this is quite interesting. Uh, Groot, especially in the film, he's actually not that much taller than a regular minifigure. Really... Um you know, say that's a normal minifigure, Groot is only about that much bigger, not very big at all. Probably could have been done in minifigure form. Um, or how they did him in the, the Lego Marvel Super Heroes video game and just done him as a large figure like Hulk. Uh, the other news is that the sounds like the large Guardians of the Galaxy set will be a large blue and yellow ship, which will assumably just be the ship that we've seen uh, in the various promotional artwork for Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, so there we go guys, that's your lot. Uh, hit me up in the comments if you've got any questions or, of course, if you want to request a, a custom spotlight video for any of these characters. Thanks a lot, guys.